All right, we are um, on, I guess it's it's part five of this blogging tutorial setup, I guess, right? We're doing response magic. And I'm gonna try to make this as simple and easy and quick as possible. And just just follow along. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you the kind of some shortcuts to get this done quick. Once you have it set up, that's the most important part because in other trainings, after you're already doing posting and trying to collect a, an email list, you're going to be adding offers and autoresponder messages to this program. So that being said, let's do the setup. The first thing I want you to do is go to homewithtanya.com forward slash thank you. And you want to literally copy and paste this page. You want to create your own thank you page. And it's real simple. I, I'll pull up here. Um, I'll, I'll show you here. I just did it on here. And um, I'm going to show you guys. So I'm going to go to thank you. And, you know, you just add a page. You're going to put thank you on the top. Just copy and paste it right over. And then just make sure you edit the certain areas where it talks about a domain name. So there's Garrett Offers there. You can change your name down here below. And, you know, you can customize this, say whatever you want. But this is a basic template that, you, you know, you want to, you know, follow. So I'll show you what this one looks like here. Same as the one is on Tanya. Um, right here it says thank you. It's just a simple thing, but you need this link. So you want to have this ready, be viewing your page so that that link's right there. And then we're going to go right to Response Magic and get that set up, okay? So let's go ahead and go there. We're going to, you can just click right here on this link. This is the one you want to use so you can get it for free. Uh, and just go to RoryRickard.com forward slash blogging. It's right below um, part five. It's here. It'll be in some other areas of the training too, but go ahead and click on that. And I'm just going to walk you through how easy this is. Go ahead and hit create my free account. Um, and you're going to put your full name in. You're going to put an email in, a username, and a password. And you'll say create my free account. Um, I Have you heard the, the password? Term? This is something you're going to be into. This is another device to help you make even more money. But I'm just going to point this out. It's going to pull this up, and it, it asks for a credit card here. You don't need to put a credit card to activate it. This is the SMS system, which we don't really use right now. So go ahead and scroll down and come down here to No Thanks. And once you do that, it's going to send you an email confirmation about your account, which you need to click, click on in order to use this. But then you're going to have access to everything to create your account and get, get it set up. So obviously I don't need a new account, I have one. I have a very big one with them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and log out and I'm gonna log back in under my account and show you how to set everything up. Now, what we wanna do is we wanna create an opt-in form and we also wanna create an email list. And we're gonna start with an email list and what I'm gonna do, you're just gonna create an email list and you're gonna put a title for the email list and I'll put uh, GarrettOffers.com too I already have one set up. You're going to say add a list and it's going to bring it up here near the bottom. Okay. And then you're going to add a list description. It's automatic. You're going to put from first name. You know, I put Garrett as last name and then you're going to put a real email address in there and that's who it's going to be from. And you want to use an email address that you can respond to. So maybe you're posting email address, something away from your normal one, something that's just for your website. Okay. And, and it's something you want to be able to re respond to people back. These are going to be subscribers going to ask you questions maybe about an offer. You know, you want to have it real. You know, you, you're building a relationship up with your email list. And you're not going to get a ton of emails back from them. And, but when you do, you know, you can just send them to a different offer on your page or help find them something different. You'll find it to be a very good, effective way to generate revenue. And we'll cover that in trainings later. That being said, here's the confirmation URL, and that's where you want to paste the thank you page. So just I'll go up there, copy that, paste that right into the confirmation URL, and, and then go ahead and hit update. And once you've you know confirmed your email address, this is ready to go. All right? Now I'm going to delete this one because I don't need another one. The next thing we're going to do is you want to create an opt-in form. So you go to create opt-in form. And this is how people sign up.
sign up for your you know your email list and you know you're gonna come here and select a list so I'll just go ahead and choose Garrett offers we're gonna come down here for a call to action now this is your headline now what I would do is just copy what we have so I'm looking at here on the on the uh, home with and on this one and you can just simply copy this now obviously you want to replace home with Tanya.com with your domain okay and I'll go ahead and do that here oops let me copy that again there we go and I'll hit backspace here and I'm gonna put this one's Garrett offers okay and if you mess up you just redo this again you just come back here and make a new one but this is all set up your call to actions right there I really like the way that we've worded ours you can say whatever you want it's yours to do what you like to with um, do not say don't any apostrophes they, they uh, create hash marks or weird signs just use you know full full uh, English so I'll put that in there and it, it, it gives you a real preview of the form uh, we're gonna come down here to create questions we're not gonna do any more questions on this here's your submit it says get instant access what I like to do is say keep informed you'll see it you know coming pop right up here automatically keep informed then I'm gonna come down here for this thing and this is for landing pages just say no we're not doing anything with the Facebook opt-in you don't even worry about that come down here to your privacy statement and this is where you want to update it to be something like that just put your name in your domain and come down here leave this at no you don't want to be notified of all these and then right here once they fill out the form I like them to go to the thank you page so come back down here and you're gonna put that thank you page I'm gonna copy that go back and paste that right there so you want to use it again there um, this powered by message I like to use that you don't have to I, I do then you simply just hit submit and get code there's a code I'm gonna copy that and then I'm gonna go right into my site I'm gonna go right into widgets and now we're, we're in the Leslie theme and if you're using a different theme I hope it works for you um, I hope you're just following my instructions but in the Leslie theme that's what I can help you with we're gonna go right to the right content sidebar now I'm gonna go flash over here to the Tanya site this is the right bar right here so we want to put a Google Adsense link here and we want to put the response magic right here so we're gonna to go to we're gonna go right here into widgets and on the right content bar we're gonna have two texts um, so you just drag this text over to here now I've already done it we just drag one there um, you open this up and you're gonna put the response magic code right in here which I've already done you just highlight it you'll paste it right there um, and then you'll hit save And close okay and that's all you need to do on that now you'll notice up above this menu I've gotten rid of a couple things that are on here so there is meta I removed that you just click on here and remove it or delete it uh, these are the only ones I want to have on here I don't use the, the meta on here and I don't use categories categories was here as well if you see categories and meta you can leave them on there um, if you want to take my advice which I hope you always do I would just remove those and keep this simple um, I've added a text bar right here and I've added one under my footer and my other footer and these are going to be response or sorry uh, Google Adsense banners which we're going to go into right next so that being said actually before I do before I close in response magic you're going to come here let me just show you really quick um, under manage email lists this is where you're gonna have a full-on training coming from me later and you're gonna see autoresponder so I'll, I'll go ahead and pull up the one that we have here for home with Tanya and I'm gonna view autoresponders this is where you add messages you can do them in HTML or text and this one goes out day zero and this is a welcome home with Tanya emailed newsletter I highly recommend that you follow what I do this way so in case you miss the trainings or if you want to see what I do on a real-time basis just go here to the home with register and you'll see the emails that I send out and then you'll be able to basically duplicate those or, or take you know an example of what I've done to do something else for your list as you're building that 
Okay, that being said, we'll close out our response magic for now. I'm going to show you a bunch more here as I build this in a future training to come. And I'll talk to you guys all soon. <laughs> Bye for now.